The following is a presentation of The Day. Thanks for joining us. This is Live Lunch Break. That means it's noon on Thursday. My name is Rick Koster, and I'm speaking to you from the Telegraph Record Store in New London. And you're watching on theday.com. It's another episode of the Live Lunch Break, and today we are honored to have with us Paul Brockett Roadshow. And this is really a special occasion because for years uh, the Roadshow has been arguably the best live band around here because they're so entertaining as well as musically adept. But we've never had product before. Look at this. This is the debut recording. It's an EP on the Telegraph record label. It's called Up All Night. And in fact, all four of us have been up all night celebrating <laughs> this. So I'm not sure, but I guess you guys are... Mango chapstick. With ma already an inside chapstick joke, but yes, we do prefer mango around here, and we're probably going to get a, a sponsorship from Burt's Bees on that. We have Megan Killamade back here on the drums. Dave, soon to be a dad, Anderson on bass. And, of course, Paul Brockett. So this is the road show, and congratulate them, won't you, on Up All Night. Rick. Thank you very much, Rick. Gentlemen, my name is Paul Brockett, and I'm proud to be here at the Telegraph Record Shop. Thank you very much for the intro, Rick. We're promoting the brand new CD that Rick just mentioned, and as much as I'd like to think that I did it all on my own. <laughs> this beautiful fold-out CD all on my own, I did not. Once again, Dave Anderson, Megan Killamade, Paul Brockett Roadshow Band. The first song we'd like to do, bring it on down. I'd like to... <laughs> Tell my mom I'll be home in just a short, <laughs> short while. Ladies and gentlemen, the first song we'd like to do, I'd like to get, get, uh, send out to all the truckers out there taking their lunch break. It's called Black Smoke. I'm in a white faint liner on the highway blowing black smoke. And the good folks behind me in my rear. Thank you. 
played that song. <laughs> Full Black Smoke, ever since we recorded it. Put it on the back shelf, didn't think about it too much, but that was a lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Tell you what, here's one called, it's on the CD. It's like the fourth or fifth one or something like that, of the sixth song. It's called Water Rises, just like this. <laughs> Got a feeling I'm possessed from my head down to my shoe. Got a girl my feet can never hear, looking lost in blue. There's jet turned down in Tampa that will meet me in that bed. And we'll fly into New England like a cop goes for the kid. To the mountain of Lord did not speak to me, so I left my cell phone number where I could be Sorry about that, Rich. Over here. No, I'm only kidding. I'm kidding. I'm only kidding. There's only a few more people here than there was before. Rich, thanks for having us here at the Telegraph. Good Lord. Lots of pretty albums and records and record players. 
posters and things. Come on down. You got a telephone number? 860-701-0506. Give us a call. First one to call in gets a free CD. may not be a Paul Brockett Roadshow band one, but we're going to give you one because I'm probably going to lift one. I'm going to get nine or ten in my pocket before I leave, and that'll be a good time for all. Oh, here's one. It's called, let me turn this up a little bit. Call it John's song for no particular reason. Except maybe I wrote it for a guy named John to play <laughs> in his band. And it was done, it had the bow on it, and he never came and picked it up. So we recorded it and put it on our CD. John, this is for you in the friendliest sort of way. I love you <laughs> like a friend. Been dreaming about your sweet smile and the sparkle in your eyes. When you turn it on, comes as no surprise. Just one look from you, and I know what I'm living for. I've been thinking about this darling, thinking about all these sweet things. I've been wondering why you don't do me like that anymore. I've been dreaming about your sweet this kiss as it rests upon my lips. And the tenderness, your hand upon my hips. Just one touch from you and I know been thinking about this darling, thinking about all these sweet things. I've been wondering why you don't do me like that more. The darkest nights were made for you and me, darling. When the only light's the sunshine. Sponsors say something. You got to do it, uh, which would be the day paper and 
I said, I, nobody knows. It's okay. Which would be the telegraph at 860-7-something-something with the other four numbers. Call in now. Call in now. Uh, let's see. Oh, we're going to do this one. We're going to relax on and probably play it properly because it's just not on the set list. It's called This Woman. It goes just like this. Well, I get these looks from this woman that stabbed me like a thought. Hey, got to see in her eyes with fall in love. Tomorrow she'll be gone. And I wonder when I walk home, what does she go by? That woman standing next to me, but I'm still in her back. Ready to swim up, I was too dumb man. And I know that I'm a running man, and I don't mind very much about stealing cars and drinks and bars or something for my lunch. But I'm feeling love, that's another thing, and something I can't stand. But that woman standing next to me belongs to another man. Thanks for joining us on Live Lunch Break. My name is Rick Koster. We are streaming from theday.com. And, of course, this is, as always, inside the Telegraph Record Store on uh, Golden Street in New London. This is kind of an honor because the Paul Brockett Roadshow Band is with us today. And we've, we've had Paul uh, and, and um, Dave and Megan a few times. And this is the first time, though, they've ever had an actual record to celebrate. Uh, Up All Night is out. And this is the start of their CD EP release weekend, and you guys chose to do it with us. Absolutely, so and we're very we're else. very proud of that. So thank you. Now, where's this all? In, you're going to be all over the place the next few days, Paul. Uh, the, yeah, actually, on Saturday, <laughs> we'll be all over the place. Uh, that counts. We'll be, it, well, it absolutely does, and I believe it's still in Connecticut, in Meriden. Is Meriden in Connecticut? Yep. That's right. We're going to be there at the Daffodil Festival, right? Where they where they celebrate the daffodil, we celebrate our CD. 
And it's a morning there. slot, right? No, well, 11.45-ish? Uh, depends what time you get up. <laughs> I think it's at 1 o'clock. For me, it's the morning. Hmm. When do we play? Would, I think we play at 1... one. Oh, 11.45. <laughs> <laughs> what time? Right? Yeah. Come at 1, you'll miss us. So oh, what time did Ricky say? To clear, Ricky said clear this up, I think, we, I think we're doing an art festival at 145. Or, yes, exactly. Okay, tell me about that. Uh, that's later on in July. July. Thank oh. you. I thought you were going to dash from your 1145 <laughs> set to an art festival. Yeah, Rick, let's go back to, let's go to the topics of the day. So, <laughs> well, wait a minute, Saturday night Yes, here in New London. That's right, right next door. Yeah. At uh, 33 Golden Street. Right. Paul Brockett Roadshow Band, along with a special guest. Um, the Hornets. The Hornets. <laughs> Actual insects. Yeah, actually. <laughs> he's going to leave his mango <laughs> yeah. gum out, yeah. and that'll be he's swarmed with hornets. The flea markets are over with. It's all about uh, hornet things. Yes, uh, circuses. I'm holding a copy of your new EP. I appreciate that you're doing You that. are, too. Oh, yeah, I wanted to make sure we had one here. I'll hand this one to you. <laughs> Wait. So you can hold. So it. now I have two of them. Up all night. Is Up the all title. night is the name of it. Yep. Where'd you record this? Uh, right here in New London on State Street at the place that we rehearse. Uh, Jay Banta. Uh, Jason to some of you. Jason. Yeah. Very talented songwriter. Yep. Guitar player. Yeah. Professional guitar tech. And producer. Producer. Engineer. Engineer. Yeah. Which you got to be those two now anyway. Yeah. Um, hopped on and, and helped us and and took over the process and and really did a bang up job that's the, a lot of that sound every all the sound here on there that's jay's work Jay's. It's, if you've been watching or you've seen the rocket road show live you know that they are very high energy and really good players and the recording sounds live it sounds like which is good that and he that's knew the band want. he knew the sound he right. knew the band and that's what he captured and, right. and that's that I'm real proud of that. Now, Megan, did you and Dave actually lay down the rhythm tracks first? We did, Old yeah. Old school? Drums was first, and I think Dave kept most yeah, of I his beginner tracks, so yeah. Uh, yeah, drums and bass were just taken live. Yep. And then you guys hauled ass and left Paul to do the rest right. of it? Yeah. <laughs> no! That's not how it <laughs> that's works. Not, no, I'd like to think I did this <laughs> by myself. That's that's we went to the Dutch. And <laughs> 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 let, let Paul on the engine. Well... I, I guess I got no problem with that formula. Yeah. No. The other so. thing, the, the, each song on here, you hand that back to me and let me talk about it for a oh, second. There's, yeah, you <laughs> there's six of the finest songs you're ever going to hear on there. But I have to say that now Jay came in and he recorded them. Before this happened, this is a true collaboration of Dave, Megan, and myself in these songs right here. Uh, it sounds like the band. It sounds great. Uh, what? Uh, missing a name here. Um, Mike. Oh, Mike Quinn. Who did the mastering. the mastering on it? Thank you. I feel like a ventriloquist dummy. <laughs> he did the master. He did a great job. Thank you, Rick. <laughs> and uh, just really proud of it. Just really Should proud be. of it. And it's on sale now here at the Telegraph. It is. Now, if you'd called in, you would have gotten it for free. But now that offer is off the table. <laughs> <laughs> now, it'll cost you money. But come on into the Telegraph. It's here. It's for sale. It's not like this one. It's wrapped up in a real... Cellophane, you get the cellophane too, which is half the cost right there. Shrink and it actually right? comes with a CD, which this one's in my car. Because <laughs> he's listening to his own product, and that's always a good sign. I had to learn the songs before I got here, because again, <laughs> uh, again, this, this project was recorded and then graciously <laughs> taken out of our hands to be mixed, to be, uh, to be mastered. Packaged, mastered. And, and once, as an artist, it's nice to step away from the songs that you just recorded. You spent so much time writing them right. as a group. Rec uh, practicing to record, then you record them, and then you almost don't want to live with them anymore. And then right. these people, these talented people, took it out of our hands, put this all together, and then Megan came through with the layout of the actual um, uh, design. CD design. Yeah. But we didn't really have a title, and David will tell you how we came up with the title. Step to this microphone, David, and tell us. Well, actually, uh, I think it would be Paul who was uh, okay. in the middle of the night. <laughs> watching YouTube, probably, I don't know, watching Mark Bolin or David Bowie or something. Yep. And he came up with this idea that he's basically doing the same thing as when you'd sit around with 45s piled on the floor. So that's yeah. kind of the theme of the, the thing, I guess. And that's right. Look at the packaging. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. People needing to scratch that itch of needing music and 
following their favorite artists. And, and staying up all night listening to yeah. it. Absolutely. The day we recorded yeah, it, David came. a beautiful came, place to do that, by the way, the Telegraph. <laughs> But then, last but not least, last but not least, not l last but not least, and we'll get back to the music in just ah. a minute. We brought it to Rich Martin, and Rich Martin really tidied the whole package up for you. Um, now it's for you. He did it for us at the time. He did it now for you. We recorded these for you. Jay worked on this for you, and so did Mike. So come on down to the Telegraph. Pick yourself up a copy of Up All Night. Um, it only takes a few minutes to listen to. It doesn't take. <laughs> Doesn't take as much time as the title will imply, <laughs> to, <laughs> to, depending on which, what time you start listening to it. But anyway, please so do. You hit it on, very uh, proud of it. Auto repeat, and it just keeps going all night. Yeah, that would be, yeah, yeah. Now, before yes. we get back to the music, okay. where can, you got a website? Yep, uh, paulbrocketroadshow.com, I believe that is. Is there going to be more merch coming? Absolutely. There'll be pins and buttons and belt buckles. Belt buckles? Uh, you think I'm kidding? That's no, I not, don't. No, that, I don't. It really is. Belt buckles, pins, buttons, belt buckles, T-shirts, um, dinner plates. <laughs> now I'm off the rails a little bit. Cowboy boots. There's a book being worked on. <laughs> but no, no. The boots. first, the first one. Signature yeah, yeah. boots. Signature boots would be all right. You think people out there know that gum. you and I? Gum. Gum. Signature gum would be good. But anyway, all those things are coming. But really what you need to do is buy the CD because... You know, it's nice to have a T-shirt, but you, it, it, you, they don't sound like anything, really. <laughs> no, they don't. Think about it. I did. Good. <laughs> Do you think people know that you and I have been in a cowboy boot store together in southwest Texas? You know what? We I, were, I, I bet we? you, yeah, that's right. That's right. And you bought a belt buckle. Oh, I have a story. One story for you before we go. Yeah. I have a friend who brews his own beer. And um, he, he makes his own brew, which is still legal to do in America. And I needed to get him a birthday gift, and I haven't looked at it yet, but I got him a copy of Pop and a Cold One, oh, nice. uh, your book. So yeah, I'm assuming that's all. about beer, right? <laughs> He'll enjoy it. <laughs> that's exactly. That's Is that exactly what, it's what it's about? Good, because yeah. he's going to love it. He loves to brew beer. Pop and a Cold Pop One, and ladies cold. and gentlemen. Oh, thanks for the Rick plug. Rick Coster's <laughs> book. Plug probably isn't the right word either. Thanks for the, the plug. <laughs> Hey, you know, working for the day, a lot of people don't know you're a writer. <laughs> Check out the... No, I'm not even going to go I'm there. Okay. okay, listen. All right. Uh, as always, we're having a great time, and particularly with the Paul Brockett Roadshow, celebrating their brand new EP, Saturday night at 33, Saturday morning right. at the Daffodil Festival in Meriden, and we're proud to have them here today. Thanks so right. they're going to play a few more tunes for us? Yeah, absolutely. Thanks, Thanks for being for having here. Us. I appreciate it. Oh, what are we going to do? Yeah. And if I said I had a problem, would you know what I was talking about? About the way that you've been treating me, the way that you've been pushing me around. Now, if you want me to stay, take me seriously, because I say what I'm Goodbye. Yeah, what I said, baby, you know it's true. If I call it a ship, you can set it on the ocean blue. If I call it a twister, baby, getting the sail.
Up all night, ladies and gentlemen, on sale here at the Telegraph. Thanks again to the day and, and the Telegraph for having us. We're going to do one more for you called Sheep I'm In.
I guess I asked her out once, and I guess she said yes. Probably with her for a long time, at least a couple of years. Probably told me that she loved me, putting no one above me. I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe. Paul Rocket Roadshow Band, get a copy of the new EP yeah. up all night. Rick. Paul, here it is. Megan Kilimate, the master cylinder back here. Absolutely. Percolating Dave Anderson. Woo. Thank you guys for being with us and come and see them Saturday night at the 33 Club next door when they uh, debut the EP here. Yeah. Or the Meriden Festival, the yeah, Daffodil, Daffodil Festival, Festival in Meriden. 11.45 a.m., not one, as Paul said earlier. <laughs> Next week, we have a special pre-recorded uh, show for you, an episode that features Chapman Stick virtuoso Greg Howard. So all of you prog heads will want to turn in. That guy's amazing. And uh, thanks for having us here at the Telegraph, Rich and Daphne. And we'll see you next week on Live Lunch Break. <laughs>